Hello, welcome back. Let's play Dragon Ball Z Attack of Saiyans. The last part we he, uh, found out Ox King's castle's in trouble in this part. We're gonna continue on with our quest. Uh, so let's see here. Give bonus bonus attack. Give Tien your two ring. And cover mark. Give Crow in the fighter's mark. And you know what? Fuck it, just because. We have it. And for some reason, the game's starting to lag. And we have, I believe, a new enemy Snow Bandit Girl. Basic, you know, melee character. Just try force on him. Just fills. Starting people with coming out of the house. <laughs> I think this shit right here we can just fall on physical and outright kill. Okay, if a character has confusion, he'll do a random move every turn. So keep that in mind and Krillin got level up. I'm gonna increase his technique and his accuracy. Damn it, can't get it through there. I think there might be one or new enemy. We get attack water, basically increases your attack power. If it's used. And we got a new enemy, the Snow Bear. I think he should be taking a serious threat as any other enemy. Attack force. Ow, that freaking hurt. I'm just gonna keep using multi attack force for now. A lot of the same old attacks again and again, just because they're so effective. Um, and Tien gets a level up. Yay! Accuracy and defense. Let's go into skills real quick. Tien. Uh. It's just increases the rage gauge up. Yamcha, you can do what you want with him. Because personally, I don't really think he's that useful as a character. And we got another new enemy, it's called a White Wolf. My multi force attack. And 
Damn it. And this is any surprise grilling out the thrift has got at least HP, I think not. I'm just gonna let freaking Goku take hits as is. Put that down. And here we get Silver Fur. Silver Fur, I believe, allows you to walk on icy platforms. And I'll be right back. Yeah, it didn't really get anything too significant off that fight. Right. Self complete. And I'll be right back. Okay, down here we get a Kai Capsule 50. Knock this thing down. And we have, I believe this is the final new enemy, Snow Tiger. Trim like any other enemy in the game. As in. Just treat him as a standard threat. Uh, I wish I had the auto move thing. Because I would. It would make a lot of these fights a lot easier for me to get through. And currently got a level up. Yay! Uh, let's. Boost up technique and boost up defense. TN. Uh, let's boost up accuracy. Boost up speed. I'll be right back. Okay, there's one final Emmy here before I start grinding. It is the Snow Band. Uh, they're a bigger threat than the mini ones. Just mainly due to the fact that uh, I believe they're more resistant to. I'm not exactly sure if they're more resistant to coming on the cars or to physical attacks. Now it goes him. Attack. And oh, Miami. Okay, I'm gonna grind up to level 12, so I'll see you guys later. Alright. Uh, got done grinding at level 12. Oh, damn. There we go. I got Crow in the Destructo Disc, uh, higher levels. It's actually gonna prove really useful later on. Up my attack, up my crit for Goku. Tien, who really cares what he did with him, uh, I upped his offense. So he's gonna be more than just a tri beaming, uh, you know, three eyed freak. There we go. Here. Now, I'll be right back again. And I forgot I wasn't recording. Damn it. Alright. Goku gun up. Okay, this is what we're gonna need for this little bit. Go to capsules. Gas mask. Silver fur. Silver fur. So, I'll lose my freaking. HP over this, and I'll be right back. That one fight away from another level up. Okay, got sleep card. Basically, it puts him to sleep. And I'll be right back again. Sleep better yet. I have an idea to. I have the perfect situation to demonstrate the destructive disc. This is why I, I love carrying Crow around in my party. Or somebody like a Yancha or a Tien out. Just let me 
uh, get through this. Sorry, I was rendering something at the same time I was recording this, but if you saw the last bit where Structo Disc attacked both enemies, uh, that's why I like carrying uh, Corel in the quote unquote most useless character in the franchise around more than I like carrying around somebody like a Tien or Yancha. And Krone gets a low up for being so useful. Yay! Uh, plus one tech. Plus one. Accuracy. Yep. Yeah, save the game right here. Damn it! And I think I initiated the boss fight. Hey, hey! Hold it, guys! Hmm? Who the heck are you? You stole some money from Hakake, didn't you? I'm here to get it back. Emperor Pilaf? I think they're after the legendary sweet hun honey we stole. If we get our honey stolen back from us, we can't forget about. We can forget about time for cash we need to conquer the world. What? Well, well, that's no good. Haha! <laughs> you want the honey? Well, come back on up here and get it. Flip it. Okay. Did not trigger the boss fight. Okay. Just gonna do something. Get an item real quick. Get the freeze capsule. Run chance of freeze the enemy, which it might as well be a stun move. And I'll be right back. And oddly enough, when I got done with the fight, it left me right outside freaking door to the damn place. Irony. So, we can go, I think. It's up here, we have to go. But first, before we do that. Yo, it's me, long time no see. I kind of forgot to tell you about Key Blasts. Okay, we're not at the plot point where we get a level 2 Key Blast, which will not like anything that's white. Huh, give me our honey back. Oh, you guys don't know. I give up, do you? Chewy, my, get him! And if you ever had the displeasure of, like I said before, freaking drain power music from here again. Huh? And propel off just me by myself? You got it, I'm counting you, Mile. My. What? But that's crazy. There's so many enemies out there. Do we have any kind of strategy, Emperor? Nope. What? What am I supposed to do? Look. Okay. Okay, next enemy, my machine. Anybody who's a fan of the original Dragon Ball series? No, that's Peel Off. Peel Off was the original enemy from the first Dragon Ball. And uh, I think she's not particularly the toughest boss in the game, but I wouldn't call her pushover either. Not a lot you can do against that move, because all you can really do is just pray it doesn't really hit for too much damage. I'm not sure if there's a trick where you can get all three. I've tried a bunch of different ways. And usually you just want to save the character you need the most, let everybody else take damage. Two hundred damage. That's resisting. Yeki, come on, me, ah. I'm gonna try one more try. Beat. 94 hit against the wall, and come on, me, ah, leads to about 400 damage on one move. Try beam. 
Try this beam out for size. I'm gonna use my HP 50 capsule. Everybody, get the Kami on me off. Because frickin' Goku's got ridiculous frickin' MP. Half the time when I'm about to heal, I end up killing this guy. Like, when, like when I did a test run of this. Entire game, it's like, it's like, oh, I need a heal. It's like, dad. It's like it just falls over when you're about to heal. It's like, you know what? These guys are about heal. Let's come up right here. And frickin' Krillin got stunned. I'm gonna use medium. I'm just gonna use medium beam gun. That frickin' stun them both! Medium beam on himself. Yeah. It's a better idea. Save a little bit of MP on Krillin. Come on, huh? Get over the rush blast. Since he's got speed initiative. Now I'm starting to think that, you know, it doesn't really matter which one gets the hit first. It matters, uh, you know, just how much damage you're doing. Damn, this thing's got a lot of HP. Fuck it. Struck no disc. Guard up. Hit you with the Kamehame, huh? Destructive disc. Kamehame, huh? Try beam. And there we go. Victory. 1800 EXP for everybody. Tien goes level 13. Chrome goes 14. Even Yamcha gets low. Nice. Uh, let's go. Plus one technique. Plus one defense for Krillin. Goku. Plus one technique. Plus one speed. Because I want to outspeed everything. Uh, plus one. I think. Right now, I'm just gonna. Go with. You know. This setup. Check plus one. Sorry. I'm gonna go with this for a while. Just because I think the early uh, the uh, before the fight with I think there's a point where you had to go fight Napa Vegeta. I think if you're actually about 60, 70, you're good. But as soon as you get the G, I think if it's like 90 to 100, you're good. We could have handled oh, all this if you just had handed it over. Hey, hello. Oh, Hakaki. We got the honey for you back, ma'am. Really? Oh, my. Thank you so much. I made a promise with you. Here's a bit of honey for you. Team the honey. Thanks, I appreciate it a bunch. And we immediately get a squad front of the freaking dungeon. So this is definitely a place we're gonna have to come back to eventually. Just because I want all the extra items. Let's see here. 
Pump forest. Okay, Kiwi Volcano. Skip through this bit. Welcome to Kiwi Volcano. I hope you'll enjoy your stay here. And I'm gonna cut off the part right here, and I'll see you guys later.